Hi everyone, welcome back to the Drifter Journey channel. We have some good news and some bad news. We filmed this video to show you the ultimate UTV side-by-side, -side, our new Honda Pioneer 520. But we had some technical difficulties and had no audio, so you're going to get a special edition video that is fully narrated by yours truly. Please feel free to let us know what you think of the video by leaving us a comment and we appreciate you supporting the channel by shopping through our links in the description. Let's get this little Honda on the trail and see what it can do. The Honda Pioneer 520 is a two-seater side-by-side with a dump bed, seat belts, doors, and four-wheel drive. This one had been modified by the previous owner with aftermarket 27-inch tires for better clearance and traction. We bought this side-by-side -side to work on our property and to help us get further into the woods during hunting season. There are a lot of forest service roads in our area and we are looking forward to the utilitarian and recreational opportunities this vehicle will open up for us. There are also quite a few trails in our area that are only open to vehicles that are 50 inches wide or less, basically ATV only trails. The Honda Pioneer 520 meets that requirement and we're taking it on one of those trails today. Let's talk about today's video sponsor, Epic Water Filters. We love them because they are working hard to eliminate single-use plastic bottles as well as provide clean drinking water for people across the world. You can shop their household products such as this countertop filter, their in-fridge pitcher, and an under-sink mounted filter that taps into your countertop, as well as Nalgene bottles in one and one and a half liters with awesome graphics, there's a ton to choose from, and interchangeable filters. So once you have a bottle, you don't have to buy another bottle. You can just keep getting filters that are made in the USA. Uh, they make a tap water filter, which is great for everyday use. If you're looking for something for travel or the outdoors you can get their everywhere filter which filters out more particulates and bacteria etc shop the link in the description below and use the code drifter journey for a discount this trail network is extensive and we were hoping to connect a few trails to get to a hot spring we turned up a trail that was clearly less maintained and not as well used it quickly became more narrow and rocky and the terrain more challenging Unfortunately, we weren't able to go very far because we hit a downed tree across the trail. Next time we do this trip, we'll have to bring a chainsaw for sure. Thankfully, backing the side-by-side -side is much less difficult than the truck and we were able to find a turnaround pretty quickly.
Since our hopes of getting to a hot spring were dashed by that fallen tree, we settled for a nice rich top view for a drink and a snack. We're using this 42 quart, 40 liter fridge by H Calorie today to keep our refreshments well, refreshing. It's a dual zone fridge that has a smaller compartment for items you want to keep extra cold. It has a nice control panel where you can adjust the temperature. Um, right now we are keeping it at 32 degrees. It's a 12 volt refrigerator that we have plugged in into the side by side. And uh, as you can see, it has quite a bit of room. We don't have very much stuff in it, but uh, I would definitely feel comfortable taking this out for a uh, multi-day adventure. They provided us a 20% off discount code for you guys. Be sure to check the description of the video for that link to the product as well as the discount code and make sure that you find the correct uh, store on Amazon in order to find the product and get the discount to work. Greg was especially excited about this fridge size because it fits basically perfectly in the bed of the little Pioneer 520. After wrapping up our hillside snack, we loaded up Lupe, put the Honda into gear, and we're off. The Honda Pioneer is a very capable little machine and we had a great time exploring this trail. It's nice to see a different part of the National Forest that the truck can't get to. As we pulled into the trailhead a little muddier than before, we were excited to check out the next trail. Thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to leave us a comment and we will see you in the next round.